Hey Zetters, Christian here from Doofy Racing. Bit bored at the moment, and I'm about to jump into Open Sea and just look for some horses, see what's going on in the marketplace. So I thought I would um, make a video and see if we can find some gems. I'm not buying it, uh, so I thought I'd share with you guys a couple of Doofy picks in the marketplace at the moment on Open Sea. Um, the marketplace on Zed's obviously closed, so it's a good time to uh, buy at the moment. And breeding uh, gas fees are through the roof, so. Let's jump in and have a look. Um, first thing I do when I go to the marketplace, if you're keeping an eye on racing, it's pretty good to just have a look at what's been listed uh, recently and you can see if you notice any names or anything um, in this. You know, Puppy's Got Aces, first off. That was one of my horses, 0.325. I mean... I think that's a bit of a steal, to be honest. If you look at its race record here, last time I checked, it was pretty good. Yeah, 20% win rate um, out of the old famous Ace King <laughs> and Puppies in Deep, who's off um, Puppy... What is it? A Puppy and P.S. I Love You. I Don't Love You. So that's a pretty good one. Um... I know this breeding pair, this is this in my opinion is a steal. If I had ETH at the moment, I would be buying this. Um, first Rebellion is killing it at the moment. AO is a really cool coat color. It's the first coat color I bought. Um, that Ride to Redemption is a, a decent horse. It's not great, but this one here I know um, is killing it at the moment. I think that's an absolute steal to get both of those breeding pair. The filly in this pair, as I said, doing all right. Um, its odds have been around the $10 mark, Oops, even still win percent, 14. If you have 0.5 ETH on you at the moment, I would be absolutely buying that breeding pair. Um, if you don't, I will in a week, put it that way. <laughs> Pretty simple. Um, I don't look through here, seeing if there's anything else that sort of pops out from the ones that I've seen racing. F chemo. That's out of um chemo's doing really well at the moment. I don't know what this win rate's like. 0.03 sounds pretty cheap. Uh win percent's not great. Oh, that was out of Alt F4 as well. I mean, you've got some really good bloodline in this. So if you were looking at something cheap as a breeder. Um, I would definitely look at this. You know, you've got kind of a chemo. My dog's going crazy. Alt F4 doesn't have great racing um, percentages, but out of Breathless Edge and nice, uh, Ninth Sequence, who are both doing obviously really well at the moment. Um, so that could be a really good breeding horse if you were looking for something like that. That's Bruiser in the background. I have a couple of... Uh, Horses named after him. <laughs> Nothing else is uh, really sticking out. Falling Revision, that was one of my old horses. That's a Z1. So, I mean, 1.5, maybe a little bit over for, for him. I think I sold it. Yeah, I sold it for one. Um, but I think it's definitely worth worthwhile looking into if you're looking for a Philly, oh, sorry, a mare Z1. Um, you can get some good horses. Actually, this horse here, I'm just going to come back. I'm not going to spend time on all my horses, um, but just to give you an idea, this horse actually bred s &M, which has been one of my best breeders and is one of the um, key pieces to my puzzle of uh, Atari with an explanation mark that's running really well at the moment. So um, I would definitely have a look at that horse. I mean, LTD, 33% win rate as well. It's um it's had some good breeding. So if you're willing to look for a Z1, um, I would definitely be keeping an eye on that in terms of price. Um... Nothing else is really sticking out. 
at the moment um, in terms of not oh, chemos for sale. 0.65. Um, have a look at this horse. Great breeder. Look at those breeding stats. I mean, 12% after 23 wins is good. I, f I forgot I even had that horse. I haven't raced it in that long. Um, and then there's F Chemo there as well. It's an interesting horse because it's like up around the 15% win rate after over 200 races. But both of these horses aren't fantastic percentages. So that might be a key in terms of breeding. Um, if you wanted to have a look at that 0.65, might be a little bit overs in my opinion. Um, I would probably be looking at 0.5 uh, for that horse as a good price, um, just based on the breeding. I mean, look, it does win as well, which is important. We're getting we're getting pretty low down here in terms of new ones. Um, yeah, we're down to where my ones are. So let's let's head, can't jump in and I'll show you sort of what I look for. Depends what I'm looking for at the time. Um, marketplace down, you might be itching for a Genesis horse. Um, I found some really interesting horses in the. Zabo, I think it's called Zabo um, Bloodline. I think that there's some gems in there that sort of can compete. I mean, look at Ducky Mallon. Um, that's a Zabo Z4, for example. Um, and I think that they breed quite well with Nax. I think that, that that's a really good mix. Uh, I'm a Ducky on the Edge comes out of Breathless Edge and um, Ducky Mallon. And it was a really good, and even its brother, which would have been a great horse in my opinion, but it was sort of bred at the same time as I'm a ducky on the edge. So it sort of put a dampener on how good that act horse actually is in my opinion, but it still definitely has, there it is, so seductive. Um, this horse is just, yeah, I think it's got a 33% win rate or something like that, 20, 25% win rate. Um, seems to be doing pretty well. Um, so when I'm looking for other horses, it depends what I'm looking for at the time. So let's go into Zabo. Um, I want to look for Genesis, as we talked about. I've got a bit of an itch at the moment. And sometimes that'll be as simple as a um, filter I put on. Just go to cheapest and see what's happening at the moment. We've got a couple of really cheap ones going. Oh, yeah, 0.2. And then I'm pretty much just going through and having a look at what it goes, so four races, zero, zero places, not much in breeding. You're probably buying that for uh, Des, to be completely honest. Um, what have we got? Let's get rid of it. Anything going in? Just want to look what's going on in the auction as well. Uh, Genesis, 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 all Z6 is 0.2. Four, so you're looking at 0.05 for Z6s. That's a pretty good steal. Um, depends, of course, what these horses look like. But that's a really reasonable price. One race, pretty well untried. One race for a third. What have we got here? One race again. I don't know if this, uh, I can't recognize the um, stable owner on this one. I don't know if they bought a couple of horses. One race for a second. And Battle Horse Grey, is it? Hey, listen, anyone out there, I think that that's a really good um auction seems like the auction's going for 18 days which a bit long for me to be bothering with it right now um and locking in that wrap to eth but that's a great one anyone out there who's looking for a good auction jump into that and have a look um let's head back to here laughing tax Oh, 
25 starts. Again, I think we're looking at Dez horse for that one. Ten percent win rate, win doctor. So at the same price as the other two, point two is pretty. You know what? That's a, that's a really reasonable, I think, for that filly. Um, no offspring, so you've got the option for the first offspring there, which I always I don't know why I like, but I like it. Um, so win doctor, that's that's a tick. Let's just have a look at a couple more of these. Yeah, I think that that's going to be one of the best um, value horses in terms of these Genesis um, Zabos. For sure. Unraced. Get on that. The Jolt. 0.25 ETH. Anyone out there with that? Buy that horse. Let me know how you go with it because... I think that's an absolute killer. Um, what I'll do is I'll link all these horses that I think are really good into the video and the, the um, blog post as well. And um, tell me if you buy any. I'd like to know if anyone's out there actually cares about <laughs> what my thoughts are in the marketplace. Um, all right, another thing that I like to do is I like to look for breeding pairs. Some people sell them um, to, together, but you can actually look at some other ones out there as well. Um, so let's just get rid of that Zabo. We've got a coat collar. Um, let's try and find something that's a little bit rare. Let me bring up my, my breeding. Oops, my breeding templates table. Coats temp table. So let's look for a a pay a whip. What's out there in terms of Genesis horses that we can look at? Uh, cheapest again. All right. Let's see if we can find a good um, breeding pair for you guys. You know, a pay a whip situation. Unraced Z10 Genesis. Look reasonably priced. Um, it's definitely a little bit overs if the marketplace was open, but it is a super rare breed. So you have to sort of expect that. You have to be quick with them. Um, we look at, what is Astra? So Astra is a mare. So then what we want to be looking for is some Colts. So if we're going to use that as our base, let's reduce that and have a look what we have as an option here. First timer. Um, hopefully it's a non non racer. There you go. Z six Finny. Point three five. Again, a little bit overs. If anyone out there wants a good breeding pair, I would be um putting offers in. Um, personally, Astro. Point oh seven is what I'll probably be willing to pay. You've got like, I'm, I'm looking at marketplace price plus 30%, 0.06 off the top of my head. Uh, first timer um, for a Z, what is it, a Z6? I would be going 0.15 to 0.1 to 0.2. Depends how much, how bad you want these two, but I would give them Give them a crack as um, a good breeding pair. And then as I love to look at, let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. And I'm going to look at some uh, legendary knacks. Favorite. All right. Let's see if we can find some gems in here. I haven't looked in here for ages. Look, I mean, Z2 knacks are crazy cheap at the moment. 0.075, that's less than the breeding price. I only had one start. King Beaver Ranch, out of billions. That's a steal, in my opinion. Um, just based on breeding. Like, you can't breed it for that price. So, billions is a great horse still. Um, 
and I'll be looking to keep that bloodline. So I'll be looking at that Mando for sure. Get a wiggle on 0 0.0799. Good old um, salesman tactic. <laughs> we'll call it 0 0.08. So these are under breeding, minimum breeding. Like that, that, that to me is ridiculous. Even at a 2% win rate. I, I can't understand those prices they they need to be higher so i mean i'll be looking at that as well but definitely mandos in my opinion um eleven races no wins yeah who's it out of that's pretty good for a stallion excalibur average you're getting a cheap that's about as good as you're getting out of that horse. Um, cheap Z2, knack. Now we're starting getting into a little bit more reasonable prices. At least they're more than the mid breeding. Wow. Never seen a horse with that. 171 starts, one win. Out of Super Spirit, that's a good horse. Um, offspring, good. Not great, good. Yeah, again, average. It's an interesting one. I wouldn't bother racing it, but it's got some good bloodline there. So that's pretty cheap for some good bloodline, in my opinion. What's with these sales tactics? Just put it as point one. <laughs> or maybe it's on a drop, I don't know. Um, yeah. Nothing special. Let's have a look, see if we can find some decent, decent horses here. Okay, it's probably a couple of electric violets here. Let's have a look at these. So we've got female, female, male. All right. So let's have a look and see what's the best out of these two. We might even be able to pick up a um decent breeding. How is that not? A super coat. Champion stables, if you're watching, mate, I would ask why that's not a super coat. Because it should be by the looks of it. Um, yeah. No race data whatsoever. I've got no idea with this one. You've got nothing on the offspring, nothing on the parents, and it hasn't raced. Um, risk, but could be huge reward. At 0.13... Yep, I'll, I'll take that risk, definitely. Um, versus this. They look like their brother and sister. So, again, yeah, that is the super. Ooh. I might pull together some funds and actually buy that horse. <laughs> I said I wasn't going to, but... Jeez, a super coat. For 0.13, I might buy it before I release this video. Sorry, guys. Let's have a look at this electric lightning. I want to see if this is a good thing because I would like to... Uh, again, nothing special. How much is it going for? 0.1. No, not a fan. I really like this horse. So I'm going to jump back in and look for... Just to give you guys an idea of what I'm looking for as well. Um, electric Violet. I'm going to change that to Legendary and Genesis. And I'm going to look for Nax and Scythe. Why don't you show me all this other crap? There we go. I looked at that. I think I've looked at that. That's the... What are we... Yeah. So that's who we're buying, is it? Yeah. Roadrunner. Z4. Size by Legendary. One race. Not good enough for this breeding pair. Needs to get an XE now. Z2. Oh, actually, what is this? This is a filly. So let's just go one step further. No, 
have a look. Point three, ten percent win rate. I mean, that's going to shoot out the Z four exclusive. Um, possibly a super coat as well. Um, offspring. Oh, that's its parents. The parents have done pretty well. Ten percent. Yeah, I don't mind that horse. I don't know if I've seen that horse before. Um. Geez, there aren't many of these horses for sale. If you've got one of these horses, I'll probably be looking at selling an a electric violet um, bundle. I've got a couple that maybe I could probably even look to just breed myself. I think I have a horse. It's in my other stable. Have a look here. I mean, can't look by color. We need to fix that. If you're watching Z, you need to search by color. It's not too hard to find an electric horse there. No, Tim Fraser, he's a cult. Now, he was a good horse. Turn trash. Z5 exclusive. That's going to shoot out an elite. Not interested. Sorry, buddy. Oh, whoops. Uh, what else do I have in the electric wire? I think I've got other horses in my electric wire. This wasn't supposed to be about me buying a horse. Nope. Iconic Sky is a Billy. Can I search by gender? Get rid of this thing. Really annoying. Covers up the stuff. Uh, only got Tim Fraser. I mean, I could risk it with him. Maybe I'll do that. That could be a good breed pair. Um, there's definitely some gems that we found. Uh, I think that the um, Z6 bundle is really cheap. Depends how much it goes, but it goes for. But there's some other ones that we found in there for sure. Oh, let me keep that one open. Um, if you're looking for, let's get rid of that. 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 Get back at some more. Nax. Um, I want to see if there's anything that I can. Sticking out. I mean, Z2 Nax are so cheap at the moment. I don't think it's a really good time to buy. Um, 0.16, I think, is where they probably should be at. So anything below that is a steal. Um, Daddy Candy. Great name. I don't know why. King Beaver Shot. Will you race this horse? No. Nah. Ah, oh, look. That probably is pretty unraced. Four races. That could be worth a go. For a bit of a risk. You're into a risky mood. Um, let's just do one more. See if there's something that's going that I know is a good horse. I open recognize who's your daddy see he's out there all the time is it a good horse that used to race heaps uh don't know don't know if it's good after the reset that could that was a good horse i saw it racing all the time so that could be a good one um geez we're getting up on time aren't we let's have a little upper smurf have you raced? One race, one third. Not much of a race to go off for the parents. That could be all right. Um, I really just want to find a 
absolute must buy in a Z2 legendary. Man, let's see if there's something that really warrants these 0.5. Be awesome if we could filter these down further. 15% win rate nearly. So Z3. Who's its parents? Yeah, look, that's average. Maybe not 0.5, but I'll, I'll play 0.35 for that. Pretty good horse. Um, look at all these Satoshi. Someone, someone's had some fun. Unfaithful Tiger. Love Tigers. I reckon this would be unraced. Yeah, pretty good. Hey, I mean, <laughs> it's not bad. I don't know what the odds are on that one race that it had, but parents, one start, one win, two starts, one win. Z1s. That's a Z2. That's that's worth a look at, that unfaithful tiger. One more. One more. Let's have 1.8. Your, your ass going to be here, so let's have a look here. Sugar. Both Z2. One's a male, one's female. Both are truce. These might be unraced. They might have been from before reset. Yeah. No idea about that horse. And no idea about that horse. The weekend in case. So can't breed with them guys. They're not a breeding pair. They're from the same parents. Um it's odd that it shut out the same colour, isn't it? Am I looking at the same horse, Clyde? Bonnie, no. Nah. So, they're not breeding pairs, guys, so don't buy that one. Especially for that price, with no no racing. All right, might wrap it up. Do these on a regular and see if we can find some gems for you guys. Um, I ended up finding one for myself, which is cool. I'm going to buy it before I release this video. So, um, hey, cheers for sticking around if you're still around and having a look. Um, as we do more of these, you'll probably get an idea of um, what I'm looking for in the in the in the marketplace in OpenSea and how I uh, look for horses, what what I'm looking for, how I find my gems, um, and yeah, see you out in the racetrack, guys.